Hi, this is Michael from High Tech Trader. Today we're looking at uh, an 1100 binary pump. This is a G1312A. We have it hooked up to Chem Station, where you can see our flow rate is set at 2 milliliters per minute. And we're running it through a restriction loop with a pressure of 132 bar. We're going to first perform a volumetric flow test to understand the accuracy of the pump. In three, two, one, go. This pump can be run on 115 volts or 220 volts. We also have it hooked up to the Game Boy, the Game Boy and the fittings and the lines are not included. After the one minute test, we'll be looking at the switching valves to make sure they're also working because that's critically important to the functionality of the pump. Just about at the 40, 40 second mark. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, stop. Great. Here's our graduated cylinder. And looking at the meniscus, we're right on target. It's fantastic. Now we're going to be looking at the switching valves. And what we're looking to do is we're going to switch them over. And then we're looking here to click. Perfect. One of the other things that you want to do when you're looking at the switching valves is to look at the pressure fluctuation. And I know we missed it on the screen, however, what we saw was the pressure remained at about 133 bar during the switchover, which means the switching valves are working completely fine. If you have any further questions, please contact us at 609-518-9100. Thank you from HighTechTrader.com.